Hey folks, this is Joe Kennedy with Dana Lynn Farms. I want to show you our hatching operation as we hatch new chicks this spring for our free range chickens. First of all, this is a styrofoam incubator uh, and has some, uh, some see through windows and light can penetrate so we have to protect it from the sunlight during the, the 21 day gestation period of the egg so that's why we have it covered with this. Now we'll remove this and you can see that it's, the incubator is on, it's heating up and the optimum temperature for incubating these eggs is 99 and a half degrees, 99.5 to 100 degrees um, and you want to maintain that temperature and also maintain a humidity level so you have to be able to also have a little bit of um, warm water in there that will um, so you can have some humidity in there for the eggs all right let's take a look inside the incubator this is a little giant still air incubator 40 watt 110 volt AC real simple real inexpensive and real effective um, you can see the temperature is right about 100 degrees and we have several eggs in here and you'll notice that there's an X marked on these eggs in fact there's also an O marked on the eggs and that's because you have to turn the eggs every eight hours or so and you want to know what side the egg is on when you turn them so you mark one side with an X and the other side with an O usually with a lead pencil something that won't contaminate the eggshell you'll notice that there are some little reservoirs down in there that's where we put the warm water to maintain the humidity level and some of you observant uh, and also with good ears may have just heard a little chirping or cheeping sound that's because these eggs I put in just about 20 days ago and we have one egg in particular that is beginning to hatch and you can hear the living you can hear that chicken in there wants to come out you can see it's broken its way through just a little bit just a little bit See that little chicken in there. I'm gonna leave him alone for a little while. Let him gather his efforts so he can bust out and into the world. So there you have it folks. This is our little incubating method. We get new chicks in. After these are hatched I'm gonna put in another 20 eggs or so and hatch some more chickens. And we'll cover it back up here. The sunlight's not good for them when they're getting ready to hatch. Okay, signing off. I'll bring you some more video when the eggs are hatching more uh, actively. Bye bye. Don't put it on the Is it a little beak? Yeah. Oh. Is it a little beak over here? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh. Mm. Trying to get in. Yeah. Oh. I'm hardly touching. Because they're very wretched looking, aren't they? They are indeed. The birth of new chickens. They'll be big and strong like the other chickens. really trying to come out, isn't he? He really is. He's making a big effort. Oh, and that one! I can see he's the moving. thing go up and down. He's moving, yes, yeah. and it's moving. Let's put the lid on, because that's it. Yeah, they're getting cold. Getting cold, yeah. Be very careful, though. Oh, he's getting all the traps on. Mm -hmm.